guys i might have a problem like i might be obsessed with these this is just the ones that i haven't used yet i have like an entire ass drawer of the used ones this shit is amazing <laughs> Hey guys, it's me again, Raya, and in this video, I'm gonna be talking about my latest obsession, which is the Laneige Water Sleeping Mask. Just to clarify, this is not sponsored. I wish it was, but yeah. Laneige, hit me up. Oh my god, please. Actually, this video is long overdue. I already discovered about Laneige Water Sleeping Mask around late last year. It was recommended to me by my friend Van, and I also had other friends who used the same thing and said, it's pretty good! I wanted to test it out first before actually recommending it to you guys but if you already are a viewer of my channel, you would probably have seen the progression of my skin from late last year to what it is now. <laughs> Hi guys, so it's my first time trying the Laneige Goodnight Kit. So this has the Laneige Water Sleeping Mask and the Lips Lip Sleeping Mask. So it's really good so far. I tried it the night and then this is the morning. This is what it looks like when you have the mask on. So it really feels like there's nothing on your skin, just a bit, it's just a bit moist really. Um, and then the lip mask feels like you just put on a bit of lip balm. And it's not really, it actually feels really nice and it smells good, but it doesn't taste like anything. Hey guys, I was using the Laneige face mask for this trip. When I got here, my face was really dry, like it was flaky, it was crusty. Also my lips, especially my lips. It might be because it's a bit colder. And then the air, I don't know, it's weird. Just going to Manila and then going here, so it was all plain right. And I was in the airport the entire time, so my face was really dry. So like when I put on the face mask, yeah, it's not as flaky, but there definitely is still like, I can feel my pores like being so dry. Face mask is amazing. Let's see how it looks for the next few days. Uh, even if you watch my Lululoon face mask video and compare it to, I don't know, this video or my Hanoi vlog, it's already a big difference. So the Laneige Water Sleeping Mask is an overnight mask. It's advertised as a mask that will make your skin clear, bright, and well-rested and it just does that. Honestly, I don't have much sleep. I have like the worst sleeping schedules. I sleep at around 4 a.m. on average, sometimes 6 or 7 a.m. and wake up at 12. <laughs> Somehow my skin just looks like I slept 8 to 10 hours. It's a scam, I tell you. This thing is working overnight to come up with this. So unlike the usual face mask which you just put on for I don't know 15 minutes and then you rinse off which i don't because i'm lazy but for this one you actually leave it on overnight and it works on your face overnight because from what i get it um they advertise it as their sleep tox and moisture wrap technology so it has the primrose and apricot as their active ingredients which works on revitalizing your skin overnight and it also has a moisture wrap technology which locks in the moisture in your face. So especially with me, I noticed before I use this, when I wake up in the morning, you know that feeling of being so tight or like your skin feels so tight when you wake up because it's dry. Or if you use face masks, then you'd have that really greasy feeling around your skin. Like it feels moisturized but it sure feels heavy this one leaves none of that it just feels like your skin is dewy in the morning you woke up so fresh if you do want to learn more about how this works you can check out the Laneige website but also there's a video by Leah Yu she explains it way better than I do I actually watched her video before actually purchasing the face masks because I wanted to know if it actually um, if there's like a science behind it before I actually just put it on my face. I use it every day. Um, I just use a small 
because it looks like this. It looks like it really looks like Vix, doesn't it? But it smells really nice. It has um, it doesn't have a strong smell. It's not really overpowering, but it smells really soothing and it's really light if you put it on. It's really watery, so I really just put on a small layer on my face every day. Um, apparently, you're only supposed to use it like three to five times a week, but like I use it every day anyway. It works. Look at that, amazing. I really thought that one pot of this wouldn't last me much because you know me, I use my face masks every day, but it actually doesn't take up much when I use one every day. I only one pot of this lasts me for about two months or I'd say three I, I'm pretty sure I don't use up an entire thing within a month and I use it every day so that already says a lot because you really just need a little amount and it's just really light on your skin it feels like you're just putting on toner or something but it's a bit creamier although disclaimer it's not the only thing I put on my face I do still have um, a skincare routine in the morning so I usually wash my face put on a toner and then a moisturizer and sunscreen um, but for the evenings this is my only routine so I just wash my face and then put this on directly and it's all good at one point I did use this with a honey detox mask that I got from a local store they were really good so I used it alternately this um, this one for three days and then the other mask for the other four or three it really cleared out my skin you guys so it might have also been from that and then i just used this one after so i guess if you have like impurities like me at one point where i had acne then i suggest you probably use a detox mask so that one was a charcoal and honey mask and then I used it alternately with this and then after that my skin was just clear and then I just had to use this one. You can buy these from Lazada. Just make sure you get it from like a genuine store as I know they do have a Laneige store or you can order it off Beauty MNL. I first ordered these off Beauty MNL so it came as a set with this so that's the laneige water sleeping mask and the lip sleeping mask the lip sleeping mask is actually super good it also hydrates your lips that's also one of my problems i have really dry crusty lips so if i don't put this on it just it looks dead so with this my lips feel so much more hydrated i don't have that feeling of being like super dry and I need to drink a shit ton of water in the morning anymore because usually my lips are so dry that I feel like I need to drink water before I can even talk in the morning because it's my lips are that dry but yeah after the lip sleeping mask I have none of that it feels really natural too it feels like you're putting a really light lip balm on your lip but it's a lip sleeping mask and it's amazing this is a miracle worker guys I highly recommend probably out of all the products that I have used this is the one that really works and I would stick by but if you do have other detox face masks to recommend me please go ahead and recommend it down below or any other skincare makeup stuff you would like me to try yes please do feel free because I love face masks. If you watch my channel or like know me in real life, you would know that I am obsessed with face masks. I can't live a day without face masks on. Now I really just bring this with me everywhere. It's so convenient because it's also travel size already. So I can just, you know, pop it in my baggage. It has really worked for me. So I hope if you do get to try it, it works for you as well. So thank you so much for making it to the end of this video. If you like this video, please make sure to like and subscribe if you want more of these kind of content i try to upload every saturday now hey don't jinx myself if you have any other skincare stuff face masks you would like me to try makeup please do recommend them down below and i'll see you next week bye i tend to like research things before actually using them so you should too don't just take up my advice please do read up about it um search up if you might have adverse reactions to this these products before using them please i don't sue me i remember lizzie telling me that your skin is so weird because she met me around two years ago it wasn't totally bad like full-on cystic acne or anything but yeah um i still had breakouts every once in a while but now it's just 
Yeah. So my period is incoming, so I actually have like a zit right there, or like three. <laughs> this is like the worst time to film a face mask video, but I was so inspired because somebody asked me about it like re after I uploaded the previous video. So like, yeah, here goes another video. <laughs>